What is going on YouTube? My name is Willem and welcome back to Counter-Strike or some random Call of Duty gameplay or just, you know, something random in the background. Because, obviously, right now, I'm not playing it. And usually if I'm not playing a game while recording a face cam and I'm just recording the face cam, it's usually something like a vlog or something. So, yeah, I got a little confused. But I kind of did want to tell this story, and I've been wanting to for quite a while, but it's a kind of... Well, I'm going to try to make it a little bit longer, but it's kind of a very, very short story on how Solely Medicated became a... Thing. Plus Jerry during my Q&A, well it was actually like I think a week before my Q&A, but anyway he asked me where did the name Solely Medicated come from or, or how did I come up with it or something like that. And I told him just give it a week, the Q&A will be out soon and I will not forget his question. Well knowing my stupid ass I did. So during this video hopefully I can correct that mistake but it might just draw more questions than answers so we'll find out. But, and yes I'm gonna go ahead and do the long story short thing because like I said it's actually a short story I'm just gonna kinda add on to it. Long story short, when I was younger and I actually created the name in the first place, aka Solely Medicated, I was a huge fucking pothead. Even though I technically don't like the name Pothead, I don't really like the name Stoner, I don't really, you know, I don't like those kind of names because they're affiliated with, like, shows or movies or just stereotypes in general that potheads and stoners are just lazy fucking people that, like, sit around and watch TV shows and cartoons like Scooby-Doo and sit there and, you know, and eat munchies all day and they're, like, very unproductive. That's not how marijuana works. Well, at least not all of it. But granted, there are people out there like that that, like, they're not the most unproductive people ever. They're just, they're stoners. Stoner, to me, is someone who just likes to smoke pot and relax. Because, you know, there's nothing wrong with, like, say it's the weekend, you have nothing to do, just go ahead and smoke a joint, grab a bag of fucking Doritos and flip Scooby-Doo on. Honestly, sounds like a pretty good plan to me. But since I am sitting here talking about, like, my gamer tag or my technical name here on YouTube, you might wonder, and no, Solely Medicated is not the only gamer tag that I've had. However, it is one of two. I'm not one of those people that change their names on a constant basis. I have had two names on Xbox or really anything for the longest fucking time. Okay, you know what, scratch it, scratch it. I'm talking about like original kind of gamer tags, like personal choice, you know, like names on Xbox. So I'm not including when I've joined teams. Like for instance, an SES obviously was SES medicated. It was SES solely medicated, but way too fucking long to even try to hit sniper clips with because you know you know the struggle if you have a semi-long gamer tag and you're trying to go for sniper clips you'll split yourself a lot believe me like on games like mw2 or mw3 or just call it duties that have that kind of mechanic as far as the kill feed but my first actual gamer tag was madness and i i know that's kind of just like a stupid kind of name but i mean how every gamer tag that you fucking think of is stupid in one way shape or form however i did not technically pick my first gamer tag because me and my brother both got an xbox 360 for christmas like not two separate consoles just we both got one to you know play games on and so after probably four months five months somewhere around there of owning an xbox 360 we straight up begged our mom to get us xbox live and get the internet so we could actually you know play online matches and games like mw2 and call it just call of duty in general halo stuff like that and i know i'm getting a little off topic here but uh, halo and call of duty was mine and his thing like I was more of a Halo player doing wrong. I loved Call of Duty. Ever since Call of Duty 2, which was the first ever Call of Duty that I actually played. Actually, no, I did play the first one. I mean, I know I've played the first one and second one, but I actually played the first one when it first came out. I completely forgot about that. I thought I played the second one first. The only reason I think that is because every time I think of me young playing Call of Duty, it's always Call of Duty 2 because Call of Duty 2 was by far my favorite Call of Duty of all time up until COD 4 came out, so... You know, two years, that's, that's a pretty good standing relationship right there. But back to the pot thing, just for a moment, about me not liking, like, being called a stone or a pothead just because of the stereotypes associated with them. And back when I actually smoked weed on, like, a fucking daily basis with my friends, that's exactly what we do, what I was talking about earlier. Just kind of smoke some pot, hang out, listen to music, and just kind of sit there and bullshit. Maybe smoke a couple bowls and go inside and play Black Ops 2 Zombies. But yeah, it's just kind of fun to, you know, smoke and just relax, hang out, chill out say fuck you to reality for a minute. However, for me, and I'm not gonna go too far into this because this is like, this is diving into more personal territory and not so much just where my name came from, but me smoking weed and me smoking weed with my buddies was always a completely different fucking story. Like I said, with me and my buddies, we'd smoke a bowls, hang out at a friend's house, eat some munchies, watch TV, or go to my house, play Black Ops 2 Zombies, or 
you know, just hang out and relax, have fucking fun. Versus when I smoked weed, like, say, by myself, because back when I was younger, I dealt with some very severe depression. Anyway, when I was dealing with depression, I had Netflix, and I would always go on Netflix and see what the newest documentary was, like, under the category documentary, and just see if there was anything I wanted to watch. Then a marijuana documentary popped up. I cannot remember what the hell it's called, so please do not ask me, because I will not come up with an answer. But... It showed, like, all of the medical reasons people smoke marijuana, and one of those actually included severe depression. So, I mean, this was obviously a little bit later in the video, and I actually learned a lot about cannabis or marijuana or Mary Jane or pot or and every other reefer-related name under the sun. But anyway, the moral of the little depression story was that marijuana kind of saved my life for a while. And before I actually smoked weed for depression, I actually was on antidepressant pills or medication, and I just I could not fucking stand them. They made me... A complete asshole. And my mother could tell you this. Back when I was on antidepressant meds, I was twice the fucking dick that you see before you today. So yeah, that pretty much wraps up my story as far as that. And again, back to my name for just a bit. Solely Medicated was actually not my Xbox Live gamertag for quite a while because it was actually a lot of time that I did not have Xbox Live. However, around the time I didn't have Xbox Live versus when I got it, in between that was a time I fell in love with using Instagram. And Instagram, my Instagram anyway, it was called Solely Medicated, but this Instagram, and actually it's the Instagram that I currently have, it's the Instagram that I actually post to, however all of these um, pictures are deleted, and the pictures I'm talking about are just nothing but marijuana related things, whether it be a cool grinder that I got, or some kind of stoner meme, or me taking a bong rip in the morning, my page was nothing but all of that, bong hits, memes about stoners and just pot in general and pot accessories. But hopefully this video was a bit informable about my actual name and the origins of the name and how I got it in the first place and you know, the whole telltale about solely medicated. And if you're sitting there wondering, medicated, do you still smoke weed? Well, that's up to you to decide. Before I started recording this video, I got a one out back and smoked a joint, came right back in, and chances are you would never know the difference. But with all that said, I think I'm gonna go and wrap this video up here, guys. So if you did enjoy this video, please leave a like, comment. If you have not yet subscribed, share your channel with your friends, it really am a lot. And as always, game on. And I'm sorry if this video was really long. Let's get medicated. Man, let's get medicated. Let's get medicated. Well, that was the clip opportunity torn. What about?